Hello, hello everyone. Thank you guys for joining the stream. We're going to be starting in a couple minutes. Um, right now it looks like we're having some technical difficulties, of course. Uh, the game is showing up, but I don't hear any audio. So, uh, I will be right there with you guys in just a second.
my god, I've been talking without the mic this whole time. <laughs> I think that sums up today, basically. I, I think that sums up today. That's, wow. <laughs> it is a Monday. It is a Monday. Good lord. Uh, I was trying to ask if everyone was having a good day and trying to fix the stream and don't know what was going on with it. You know, the Elgato can be ficky, little fickle. Uh, I mean, it's not unusual for me to talk to myself, so I mean, it's whatever. My goodness. But hi guys, welcome to the stream. Um, it's a Monday. Good lord, it's a Monday. I hope everyone's day has been good. Um, Good. I'm glad you're having a good day. That's it's really good to hear. <laughs> Sorry if I'm like a little frazzled and feel like putting on my makeup today. It's just it's been a long day, but I'm glad to be here with you guys and streaming and just trying to decompress. That's mainly why I stream, so I can just sit here, decompress with you guys, um, and just try to forget that I work an eight-hour job. You know. <sighs> All right, so last we left off, we were trying to figure out um, the whole cat situation, um, find clues of the cat's crimes. We went to all three locations where the um, where the cat's clues were, and now we're gonna go back to the market and we can fix the issues that was happening. Was it? The market, or the, you know it. No, it was the market. It was the market. Turn this down for myself. Also, happy Aquarius season. Aquarius season, let's go. One of these days, I'm gonna go get it. Alright, Mr. Blacksmith. Only evidence could possibly change my mind. Well, here you go, sir. The man's beady eyes. Donnie! Hi, Donnie! Thanks for joining in the stream. The man's beady eyes go wide with anger as he reads through the paper. Why, that no good cat. The whole market could have gone up in a big ball of fire. I think it wanted to. <laughs> I take it you'll let the Chandler off the hook? Sure, sure. Looks like he wasn't involved in this plot. Though I still don't care for his candles much. Okay, well that's a personal problem. Excellent. Maybe with the three at peace we can get to the bottom of this. Well, we already know what's at the bottom of this. It's a cat that likes to sit here and mess with people. Also, I apologize for not having the chat in the in the overlay. I will be working on that tomorrow. And hopefully everything shall be set up for the stream on Wednesday. Um, I believe the baker was over here. Or was it candle? Hi Jim! Um it was candle. Okay. Have a break from class. Nice. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. Something just popped up on the screen. Need to make it go away. doing that's so weird okay very strange all right obs is acting up cool that's fine but yeah i'm glad you were able to take a break from class are you doing late night classes now Jem? i know you said that you were close to graduating 
evidence or get out. Well, I got it right here for you, sir. The Chandler's cheeks flush a bright red, stomping and shouting at the cat's confession. Why, that yowling pest. That's my whole livelihood she's messing with. Man felt. Oh, no. Why are we doing this? We just, we just gonna hit you with the sign. We do, no? Oh, no? You don't want, oh, you don't wanna? You don't wanna? Okay. Well, you know, you can read my palm. And then we can focus? No? Oh. The history of literature and culture through food. Ooh, that sounds so good. That sounds like a fun class. Oh my goodness. I need you to focus on me. Why are we doing this? I, like, I, like I told Donnie in a, in a separate chat, there is no remora stream without there being remora problems. And remora problems are technical difficulties. Ugh, please. Please. Focus on the hand. Focus on the hand. Okay. So keep focusing on the hand. You just- you just don't wanna! You just- okay. Shoo, we about to- Hello! Hello! Now focus, please! Oh my goodness, you don't wanna focus! You don't wanna focus! Why don't you wanna focus, my guy? You just- you just don't? You just don't? Okay. Okay. Focus, focus, focus. 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 Come on. You know what? The whole stream's about to be like this. I don't care at this point. I'll just I'll just sit right close up for you guys. God dang. Ugh. Why? Why must why must there always be a problem? Ain't no stream like a remora stream because remora streams have problems. That's the thing, like the lens is fine. It's all smudgy, but. Huh? Hey, again! Why? Why must you do this? The people must see me! They must see me! Why? Why you. Yeah! See, this, what? this is the problem with webcams. Like. Oh, no, here's the. Here's the. Oh, hold on. Here's, here's the wedding ring for you guys! Yeah! Yeah! My veiny ass hands. I don't care. No more. I don't care. It's gonna be fuzzy. Well, everyone who joins in, I'm sorry. The cam's messing up, but we gonna keep rolling. Maybe it'll fix itself. I was able to fix it last time. It doesn't want to fix itself now. Eh. 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 Oh. Oh well. Oh well. I don't care. We're fine. If anyone comes in and asks what's wrong with the cam, you guys know. It's a remorse stream. That's why. You agree that Baker's innocent then? Him? Pah. Looks like he didn't have a hand in this horrible crime. But his bread's still stale if you ask me. Y'all? Y'all need to chill. Why can't y'all just get along? God damn. As long as you three put a stop to this ruckus, maybe we can put an end to this grudge after all. I'll keep my eyes peeled for that damn cat. She won't show her nose around here again, that's for sure. Oh, yeah, because I'm going to go collect her soul. I'm going to go kill her. What was the name of this store? I don't think I ever got a chance to read the name of it. Undying Flame. Oh, that's a badass name. Hold on, folks. I gotta add that to my writing list. Undying Flame. That's a badass name. What? That's crazy. I like that. I like that. Picasso. All right. Writing names. I can't spell. 
Undying Flame. That's a cool name, bro. <laughs> write that down! Write that down! <laughs> Basically. Wait, excuse me, pardon me, excuse me, excuse me, pardon me. Anyways. Bake it till you make it. That's such a cute name. I like that. I like that. Also, hello to anyone who just joined the stream. Thank you guys so much. I am having a little bit of technical difficulties here, but we do what we gotta do. The show must go on. I have a bad habit of anything that, that um, anything that tends to go wrong, I kind of uh, freak out and decide, you know what, time to bail. But uh, I'm trying to get better at that this year. Good luck in class. Oh my god, it's just getting fuzzier, isn't it? Oh my goodness. You're just getting fuzzier. Okay. Oh, you just, oh, you just don't wanna. Okay, you, you straight up just don't wanna. I mean, I could do it without the, uh, without the cam today if you guys want, I don't mind. Like. This really- Yo, that's okay. I'll just sit up close, I guess. Anyways. Well, have you got any evidence yet? I sure do. The baker's brow arches in anger as he reads the cat's confession. That unrefined little urchin. How dare she tamper with my buns like that? You'll forgive the blacksmith then? Huh? Well, sure. Doesn't like he was involved in this at all. Wow, the baker's the only nice one that had nothing bad to say. Splendid. If you three can get along enough, can get along long enough, we can bring the real culprit to justice. Now that these three fellows have cooled down a bit, I better have a chat with that purple, with that plump purple pony to figure out the best way to confront this swindler. Return to the unicorn! Okay, yeah, since the cam doesn't want to try and work today, I'm gonna go faceless today. And we'll see if the cam wants to try and work some other time. Nope. I don't have those connected. While I'm doing this, let's go ahead and connect these. Uh, wait, where are you? Where's the group? Group selected. Uh, cam layout, I guess. And bye bye. <laughs> All right, cool. So yeah, I'll try and get the cam fixed sometime soon. Sometimes it just likes to act the way it wants to act and doesn't want to listen to anybody, but. We shall do our best. We shall do our best. So in the meantime, let me just make this bigger for you guys. Move it around a little bit, you know. You know. And there you guys go. And I promise to have all technical issues fixed by next Wednesday. Well, by this Wednesday. But anyways, let's go. This was down here. Yeah? No, right here. Why is it still sad? Oh, Joy, you're back. Did you find anything in those shops? It would appear your market is plagued by the mastermind schemes of the cat. Well, not so masterminded. She did leave behind a bunch of clues for me to find. Oh! As though summoned, a furry shape somersaults. Somersaults? Come on, bro somersaults onto a nearby rooftop with a flourish. Yeah! I see you're a fan of my genius accomplishments. Well, you're in luck. Soon I'll have this whole village at my mercy. Ma'am. You don't have a life, do you? Quickly, your magic horn! The unicorn shuffles its stumpy legs to get a better shot of the monologuing feline. With a flick of her tail, the cat disappears, leaving only her voice cackling in the air. Yeah! You'll have to be faster than that, slow folks. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm not very manu 
maneuverable in high pressure situations. Oh, unicorn, same. I'm the same, bro. I struggle under pressure. Under pressure! Ah, don't fret. We'll just have to make sure she stands still next time. Oh, oh, bro? Are we binding her? Are we wrapping her up? I should be able to concoct a tantalizing kitty treat strong enough to keep her attention. I'll set up I'll set it up by that big statue there. You just get ready to fire. Wait, did I have it? Oh, I shouldn't have that ready. Alright. In order to make this, we need Oh, okay, so I already have two out of the three. What is this that I need? What is Mimic's toe? Oh! Bad. I know what that is. Okay, so I need more skulls, which means I need... Was it this that gets rid of the... I think this was. Let me make sure before I try to make anything. I'm pretty sure it goes down to the I need to go down to the graveyard. And there's big old floating skulls. Spirit salts. Bet. I'm gonna craft a couple of those. So I'm pretty sure there are more of those skulls. Oh, oh, hello, hello. Yeah, there sure are. Cool. Yeah, I wanna craft a couple more. Okay, so I can make one more of these. Oh, Mandry! 
interesting places. Apologies. Let me do with the major ourselves a minute. Hey, and soon with this one being done, then we can focus on the rat and maybe we can get the rat done all in one sitting. That would be great. that one minute that wants to sit here and be an asshole. Where are you? Are you down here? There was one down here. I know that's for sure. Yeah, you little hoe! <laughs> Wait, did that happen? Oh! <laughs> Where's the other one? Now! Oh! Hello! Oh, you think you're safe? You think you're safe from me? You're not! Come here, Momo. Nah. <laughs> yes! I am very satisfied. Very, very happy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And with that, I can make this. I don't even know what that other thing was. What is this? Pigeon speed. Oh, I guess that's from like when I killed some of the other birds back in earlier playthroughs. Get to a Witchwood stream, and the first thing I hear is a witch cackling. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, I see. I'm having some issues with my cam at the moment. It's, well, my webcam. It's, um, it's not trying to focus and I don't know why. So I'm like, hey, it's just gonna be a faceless stream today. So far, um, what you've missed is that we, um, got all three of those shop owners to stop bickering with each other. Um, we turned in, uh, well, we came back over here to the unicorn, let them know that, hey, we got everything fixed just for the cat to show up and, you know, gloat in our face, and then ran off before we could, you know, shoot them with the little truth serum beam thingy that the unicorn apparently has. So, yeah. Uh, we had to create a special little cat toy. Um, I actually don't know where that is. Hold on. Oh. I guess it's just in inventory, but yeah, I had to make a little stuffed bird. Um, I got to, so the cackling was actually because I made this, the skeleton key, and found out that it's used to stun them. Can't get the camera to focus on anything. It really is just like, of course, yeah. You know, you had to be so loud about that accuracy. You know, you, you didn't have to. I'm gonna go back to the game. Maybe you're on to some- wait, where am I supposed to- Wait, what statue? Which statue? Isn't it this statue? That I'm supposed to use it? Hold on. I made the cat toy. Right? It was the cat toy that I needed to make, right? Don't tell me I wasted this. Don't be mad. Cause it's in the inventory now. Charming rough facsimile of an actual avian. Okay, so yeah, where do I put this? Thing? Oh, okay, I just have to go up to the statue itself. Let's see, what will I need to lure that cat? I have what I need. It's just not showing up. <laughs> Hold on. I made the thing. So. I am confusion. Okay, hold on. What am I supposed to do? 
do with this. Because now it's... Now it's here. I have it. I made it. What? Let's see what I can... Yeah, I made the thing! Hold on, I'm confused! Hmm, maybe you're on to something. Okay, yeah, I made it. Yeah, lure the cat to the market, craft a feline- Oh, I'm dumb. Okay. I haven't finished it yet, that's what it is. Okay, so I made that, so then... What? There's like a little podium thing. Oh! Oh my god, I'm blind! Good lord, I am blind! Well, good thing I can just make this, huh? And then... Witch Spice? I believe that's what that is. Which I can already make. Blessings. And now, I can make this. My gosh. Can you tell that I'm tired? <laughs> okay. Alright, let's... The statue. You place down the scrumptious looking cat tree and duck behind a pumpkin to hide. There's no way I'm small enough to hide behind a pumpkin. Within moments, you hear the telltale laughter of the cat over the market stalls. Yeah, ha ha. That's the best you can do. What do you take me for? A basic alley cat? Who need more than a lump of garbage to catch me? Despite her lofty words, you see her eyes go wide and her tail flick as the scent of fish and catnip reaches her nose. I feel like the camera... camera's focused now. Wait, hold on. I hate this little thing here. Can this, like, get out of the way? Ugh. Mmm. Maybe I just widen this out so I can... There we go. God, technology is not my friend. I promise. Why? I'm the most sophisticated criminal underlord this world has ever... Say, what is that? Tuna? You give the signal to the unicorn, but see that the beast is still facing entirely the wrong direction. Ugh. Must I do everything around here? Fuzzy and out of it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, the cat is so cute and small. Face the right way, you goddamn lump of flesh. Come on, man. You slap the unicorn on his haunches, jolting it out of a daydream. Huh? What? Oh, right, the cat. Golly! The beast carefully takes aim, making sure to account for drag and wind speed direction. If you don't shoot the damn beam! Alright, I've got her this time. By the light of the truth, I banish all lies from thee. A brilliant sparkle of rainbow light emits from the unicorn's horn and streaks towards the preoccupied cat. Oh, 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 well, well? I think you killed it. I think you I think you killed the cat. I think that's what happened. When the colorful smoke clears, you can't see hide nor hair of the cat. Only a smoldering pair of fancy leather boots remain near the statue. Puss in boots, is that you? Wow, for a moment there, I thought all that talk about your magic horn was pure hogwash. I would think that too. I I mean, usually it doesn't have such an explosive effect. I only meant to expel the lies from her, but... I guess she was all lies? Didn't have a truthful bone in her body. Wow. Well, whatever the reason, I suppose she won't be blighting your market any longer. Yes, that's right. I can't wait for life to get back to normal. Thank you for all your help. You glance at one of the cat's boots slumped over on its side. I better go gather her up. I want these boots. Oh my gosh, she exploded into a bunch of cats. That's funny. You pick up the smoldering boots of the cat. A rainbow hue radiates off the leather. They smell strongly of feet and candy. Ooh. The 
soul of the cat. Though you suspect she may have eight more lives left. Ha! <laughs> oh my gosh, she exploded into cats. That's funny. Alright, so now we have finished that. Yeah! So, let's go and finish the rat in the graveyard. So now we'll focus on the rat. Explore the haunted house north of the graveyard. Spooky sounds are emanating from the abandoned mansion that lies up the road. And in order to get there, uh, quickest way would be through here. Water people. <sighs> All right, let's go up here. Why can't I get past this? Hold up. What? way for me to get rid of these. There's no way. Dog. There's no way. Can I open these? No? This is bull! I wanna go upstairs! What is this? Coat of arms, the once proud sigil of this manor's owner. Bro, those things are gonna aggro me. They're gonna be- Aw, hell. As you walk through the dilapidated estate, the temperatures drop drastically. The floorboards and walls groan angrily as if the whole building is upset at your invasion. Oh no! A gust of wind suddenly rushes up the staircase as though the house itself was drawing breath. An ear-splitting scream stirs dust from the rafters and makes your knees weak. I don't want to be here. At all. Ah, that's definitely the melodious voice of a banshee. Or I'm a chicken's aunt. You take a step forward, but ghostly, skeletal hands rise up through the creaking floorboards. They reach out, grasping, and you feel your spirit fade at their frigid touch. You're all lucky I misplaced my specter sickle, or I'd cut you down like weeds. I guess I should report back to the graveyard keeper anyway. Or well, the gravekeeper anyway. Ain't no- I can't walk through this- Oh! Your footfalls gain conjure- Again conjure many grasping spectral hands, clutching and scratching, so as to keep you from going any further. I'll need some help from the gravekeeper to calm those grabby ghosts. Fine! I could literally- Man! Whatever. That's fine. Why? 
safe keeper. They won't let me in. You're back. It's a demon from the underworld, isn't it? Oh, or maybe a lich come to summon up an army of darkness. Relax. It's just your run-of-the-mill banshee. A banshee? I knew it. No wonder the dead have been dead have been so angry lately. How are they supposed to get any rest with all this racket? Hmm. But a spirit can only but a spirit only becomes a banshee when it's been terribly wrong. We used to live in that house. I don't rightly know. It's been abandoned since before my time. Always was pretty creepy though. The place was so haunted that I couldn't get it in that I couldn't get in for a better look. A good exorcism ought to clean it right up. This sort of stuff happened often. Why, just last year, I had to deal with the ghoul that wouldn't stop breaking into the crypt. Darn fella was trying to find his long-lost love or something. The old man turns to rummage through his cluttered shack, looking for something. Anyways, eventually I had to call in the Grave Squad exterminators. They got that nasty ghoul rounded up before he befouled too many tombs. But they left behind this, uh... because of those possessions. They get recalled? Huh? Look at that. I never heard nothing about that. Now, this thing ain't powerful enough for banshees, but it should keep the lesser spirits away. He gives the lamp a shake, but only a puff of purple smoke rises out of, uh, off the wick. Oh, Lord. I don't want to watch this. Oh, no. Not watch. <laughs> My brain is tired. Jeez, oh, looks like I forgot to keep it fueled up. Man, you just... Do you want me to help you or not? You're making my job so much harder than it needs to be. I had to go and get the gas myself, but the graveyard in this state. He shrugs feebly at you. Oh, you're hopeless. What does the ghost lamp need for fuel? He squints at the fading label on the back of the lantern. Let's see. The phantom goo feels as if it's attempting to pull you down beneath the soil. No, thank you. Don't want that. Alright, so I need to get bat wings and crawler silk. Okay. So, I remember how to get the bat wings. I believe I remember how to get the crawler silk. I think with the crawler silk I need to um, kill some spiders, in which case I need this. So I need more this. I just need one, so I'll go ahead and make one. And then I need... I think this was for bats as well? Yeah. And I need two of those. Just in case they don't give me what I need. Let's make two of those. here. Yep, yep, go ahead and look at it. Come here. Oh, well, now I have some extras just in case. Yeah, see? See? I was right. I was correct. Hello, doggo. Alright, let's go over to the crypt, because that has what I need. Yep, go, go! Yep, 
again. Oh, two of them. Now harmonize. <laughs> All right, so now we bring it around town. Sir, oh wow, I walked right past you. Hello. All right, so we got the bat wings. The webbed wings still flap on their own of their own accord. No, thank you. Don't like that. Crawler silk is thick and smells oddly of lilac. Why well, smell like that? I seem to have misplaced my reading glasses. So maybe you better prepare the mixture? You read off the well-worn pr instructions printed on the lantern. They're horridly confusing and riddled with spelling mistakes. Oh no. How did these contraptions ever make it to market in the first place? You better stand back. If I do this wrong, things might get a little exploding. Um, you grind together the gruesome ingredients into a waxy paste before rendering the whole mixture down over the gravekeeper's cooking fire. The odor coming from the wet, bubbling soup makes the hairs on your nose prickle. <laughs> but you power through it and pour the ghastly oil into the lantern with a rusty Gravekeeper raises one caterpillar like eyebrow at you. No kaboom? Perfect. Give her a good shake. Why? Hello everyone to just tuning in. Thanks you guys. Right now I have some cam issues going on, so I'm doing faceless today. We just well we finished the cat earlier today, so now well not earlier today. We finished it earlier in the stream, so now we're working on the rat. You swish the oil around inside the lamp and light the wick. Slowly, a bluish, unearthly glow fills the space around you. Ooh! Take a look at that! Fresh as a daisy! Just wave it around should any wayward ghoulies try to... try to accost you. Oh, I can go after those hands now. This should clear the way up to that miserable banshee, if and maybe... You could ask her what all the fuss is about. <laughs> Where is it? Yeah, my first victim. What? What you gonna do? Huh? What you gonna do? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Oh, we ain't extinguishing nothing up in here. <laughs> Menace to society. I should extinguish that thing. I don't want it to try and go out on me for any reason. Now I can go up in here and raid that chest. Take that, thank you. Is there anything else? No? Excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> there must be a way I can soothe your pain. Oh. That's actually kind of sweet. Oh, there's 
a banshee. Okay. I don't really want to deal with her right now. I kind of want to see what else is going on here. Can I do something about you? Lock test. No, I don't want to. No. There we go. Exorcism. I want to use that. Uh, here. I believe I have it. Yeah. Let's replace you. And then... Do I have another one of these? No, but I need another batwing in order to make one. The spirit must be exercised. I don't think I want to do that yet. Wait, there's a lock chest. Despite his age, this, this strong box has retained its function admirably. Man! I want to loot the place! Ma'am? Ma oh, God! Oh! You, um... Come to taunt me as well. <laughs> oh, Lord. Taunt you. I've come to find out why you're throwing such a tantrum. You raised the dead with your wailing. Whoa. Okay. The race jaw drops to her collarbone, howling as her ghostly arms reach for you. You quickly raise the ghost lamp high, bathing the room in cold light. The spirit recoils away, covering her eyes with translucent hands. It burns! Why do you torment me so? Ma'am. Ma'am, you're too dramatic. Oh. <laughs> oh, quit being so dramatic. Now tell me what's got you so upset. It's gone. That sneak, that thieving, plague-ridden rodent stole it. What's gone? Who stole it? My family's crypt was defiled by that wretched rat. My most precious treasure! My brooch, it's gone! I hope you guys enjoy my acting. <laughs> it will not- I will not rest until I have it back! <laughs> this is fun. Ah, uh, the rat stole the brooch from your crypt. That's enough to make anyone upset. Yes, it was stolen! Ripped from my breast! Where has it gone? I would have preferred this banshee over the one that Icy made me fight. Well, if the rat pilfered it off your remains, maybe he left it behind a clue- left behind a clue as to where he ran off to. But that crypt is jammed full of caskets. How will I know which box is yours? What was your name? I... I don't remember. Who was I? Everything is clouded by my suffering. Well, this was your house, right? There must be some relics in here that can point me in the right direction. Oh god, that's tiring. Okay, okay, I get it. I'll get to the bottom of this and you can stop all this howling. Family crest, I know that's down there. Position in family. Order of death. Is this something? No? Oh! Okay, I was kinda right. This corroded picture frame has almost completely deteriorated. You can barely make out ghostly figures sitting together on the rotten canvas. Shame. Time has almost forgotten this family. Maybe I can restore just this little piece of them? Craft a restoration- oh, sorry, restorative doll for the destroyed portrait. Ooh, okay. Let's try it. What do I gotta make? Alright, so it's here. Ooh, good thing I got some of those roots. Alright, so I need to make... Where are those? Hold on. Oh, this. Okay. I need to make two of these. Make that, make that. I need to make this necromatic charm 
Oh, I get to fuck up those little pumpkin boys. Okay. And that. And I just need one of those, right? For this? Yeah, I just need one necromancy charm. So for that, I need to go to the field, cut up one of them little pumpkin boys. Um, I should try to... I'm sorry, I don't mean to hurt you. I'm so sorry. Can I have the chest, please? I would like to open the chest. This heavy box seems like it might contain important family documents, but it's locked tight. Hmm, I doubt the key is anywhere around here. I better just make my own. Hey, I got that. I got that. Alright, so. Let's swap out this for this. Open up! You crack open the chest to find a collected, eh, a collection of moldy papers and bills, but a heavy book at the bottom looks promising. In the cracked leather bound tome, you browse through long forgotten obituaries, and we mourned her death the third of her siblings to pass. Much beloved, she will long be remembered for her beautiful singing voice and tireless pursuit of justice. Oh, well, that's definitely her! Sounds like our banshee, the third to die. That will mean that her casket will be the third one in her row. Ah, interesting, interesting. I know the family crest is down here. Yeah, move out the way. And this. This embossed shield looks like it might be a coat of arms, but the face is so badly encrusted with a Tina? Or Patna? What is that? Hold on. Nerd alert. I want to look up what this word is. Patina. A green or brown film on the surface of bronze or similar metals introduced by oxidation over a long period. Oh. So is that what's covering the... Um... Oh, what's the what's the damn thing in New York? I can't remember now. Statue of Liberty? Let me see. Yeah, that's what's covering. Oh, that's cool. The Statue of Liberty's iconic green patina was fully formed by 1906, and it continues to protect the underlying copper from additional chemical reactions. That's cool. Nice. You learn something every time with my channel. Alright. But the face is so badly encrusted with patina that you can't quite make out what it is. Hmm. Good cleaning ought to get this looking spick and span. Hey! I have some! Oh no I don't. Damn. <laughs> Too good to be true. Alright. That's fine I guess. Alright. How do I make this? Oh, I need Spectre Goo. Oh! Okay, cool. And I need water, so I need more jars. Oh. I need a couple of these. Let me just make three. And then I can get the water from up over here. Oh, can I not unlock you? Man. I should be able to. get this in the last hour cool, cool, cool. so I need water wait wait why is hold on no no oh I thought I filled with water but there's something weird about oh I'm mad and that was a waste. I feel attacked. I feel attacked. Cause this is some bull. Done. At least I know I can go and get that without having to craft anything else, I guess. Man. That's so annoying. I 
Okay, I'm actually bothered by that. get this done before before the end of the stream that way the next stream we start off brand new not in the middle of another quest we end up just working on the maiden stuff and get more story done for those watching that haven't um, that doesn't that don't really know what's going on make sure to watch my earlier videos I did start this as a series and then kind of um, stop so I could try to play some other games just to see uh, which games would do better on the channel, but I'm not really trying to chase what is good for the channel. I'm just playing what I want, but there's earlier story that I have a whole playlist that this is part of. Um, I'll make sure to put a link in the description for it, but yeah. Um, alright, I need vines. I think I could mess you guys up with like No? Or was it salts? I think it was salts for you guys. Was it salts? Yeah, spirit salts. Alright. Walkie well, dokie. I'm not worried about y'all. Oh wait, I'm wor kinda worried about y'all though. Try to craft some more real quick. Awesome, awesome. And then we'll make. Oh, I need more of these. Let me go up here, get some more of these salts. I need to get past that thing somehow. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna get past it one way or another. One way or another, I'm gonna find ya. I'm gonna get ya, get ya, get ya, get ya. One way or another. There's um, more ways for me to get one. Yeah, the control. these while I can. <laughs> grab you, grab you, grab you. Uh, yep. Awesome. Fine. I don't care if you get mad at me. I got things I need to be doing. That don't involve you. I need to dig up some more. Well, actually, I should be fine, actually. Let's try and make this now. Yeah. There we go. I have enough to make two. I really just need one, though, I think. No. Yes? Let's make two just in case. So I needed that so that I could make... What was it I was making? Oh, my goodness. The water. And I needed to make... The little restorative doll? Yeah. I wanted to make that. I needed... Okay, so let's go ahead and roll over to the field so I can go get the little pumpkin bone. I don't remember 
remember what I needed in order to chop up the pumpkin bowl. We shall see. We shall see. To the fields. To the fields. Sunflowers. My favorite flower. Hello, whoever just joined in. Thanks for coming in. Right, pumpkin boys, pumpkin boys, where are you? I think I can go through this way. Okay, those are cute. Where are All right, little pumpkin babies, where are you so I can chop you up? Y'all are mean. Where it was, it was this way, right? Right? Oh, did I just completely? Yeah, I sure did. All right. No, not here. Is it the next field? I think it's this field, yeah. Nah, don't y'all run now! Snag vine. That's what it was. Please tell me I have one. I can make one- oh, wait. Well, I- yeah, I guess. Okay. I really just need one bone, so let's make that. This maybe I can get both of these. That'd be great. Wait, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, maybe I can get both of you. That'd be great. Ah! Oh! I thought I got both of you. No, wait, stop. I just need this. Please wait. Yeah, you can aggro me all you want. I don't care. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Go away. Go away. That's all I needed. Okay, so. Now, I have you. I can make you. And... Now I can make you. Perfect. I have the salts already. Um... Okay, so I have you, I have the salt, so that I can now get some goo, and I can make that water. Uh, let's go back ah! This will be the quickest way. These little things are mean, I hate y'all. Any other time, I like pumpkins and stuff. Y'all are mean. I do not like y'all at all. Very rude. Sorry, I'm back. I had to get dinner going. No problem. What are you making for dinner? Oh, this way. some more potatoes to go with the steak I cooked last night. Yum! Love me some steak and potatoes. Sounds good. My husband and I ended up having um, Korean barbecue like two nights in a row 
over the weekend and my god, I want to start trying to do more barbecue at home like that. So freaking good. Uh, today, what do we have today? I think I have some leftovers. On Wednesday, there's a Mediterranean sh um, shop opening up nearby. Um, it's their grand opening, I think. So we're gonna try and hit that up. And then Friday, there is, so one of our favorite locations that also he supplies cakes for, cause he's a pastry cook, well, pastry chef, sorry. Um, he does, he makes cakes for different types of restaurants and his dream is to one day open up his own bake shop. So this one place that he's been supporting for a little bit with making cakes, he has been, um, like the food is just amazing over there. So we like to go over there and eat sometimes and they're gonna be moving locations soon, so we wanna go over there and support them before they move. Um, it's a, what was, what was the combination? It was Filipino and Mexican? I think, it, I know for sure it was Filipino. Um, I can't remember the other part though, but it was like a really interesting, you know what, yeah, I think it is Filipino and, and Hispanic, there we go. I can't remember what type of, of Hispanic, but yeah, my god, the food over there is good. I've been wanting to go to a Korean, Korean barbecue place for the longest time. I highly, highly, highly recommend doing it. It's so good. And there's Korean barbecue, there's Japanese barbecue. We'll be, so for my birthday um, next month, I'm going to Universal Studios, but there's apparently a Japanese barbecue spot that is um, somewhere in Orlando that my brother really wants to try and go to. So I'm like, okay, we'll go and eat there for my birthday. I'm very, very excited. Okay, so, sorry. <laughs> um, so... Bloodsuckers and Ghastly Head. I think I needed, oh, okay, so it's actually okay that I made that, let's see, inspectors, what was, what was it for these, what was it for these, exorcism charm, which I believe I still have, yes I do, perfect, let's actually replace over here. to do so much to do oh wait did i open that no man this is part of the decor oh that's really cool man i need to go out and try a new place honestly that's the best thing about being married to my husband the very first thing he ever told me when we were considering dating was i hope you like traveling for food but mainly i hope you like traveling in our five years of being together, five years of dating, it'll be a year of marriage um, next Halloween, so this Halloween. Um, we have, I think in our first three years before COVID, we traveled everywhere for food. There was no place that we were like, eh, we don't really want to go there. It's always been, hey, this spot looks really cool. You wanna go try it out? Yeah, sure, where is it? It's all the way in New York. Yeah, that's fine. Let's make a whole trip out of it, mainly just so that we can go to this one place and try it. That's how our relationship has been, honestly. It's, it's so much fun going to travel for places to eat. It really is. It helps broaden your horizons. I learned I like radish for the first time. I never thought that I would like radish, ever. Now I know that I liked, that I liked, um, oh, what is it? I think it's the same 
type of seasonings for kimchi that that this Korean barbecue spot used for their radish, I have to learn how to make that because my god, that was absolutely delicious. Man, amazing, amazing. You clean away the grit and grime to reveal a proud lion staring back at you. The crest looks like it makes one of the burial... Oh, like it matches one of the burial rooms in the crypt. <gasps> oh. Oh, guys, we're getting somewhere. All right, all right. Color and light flood back into the faded painting to reveal a content-looking family. You recognize one of the younger girls by her shock of hair and brooch on her chest. That must be our wailing wraith, a granddaughter by the looks of it, so she must be on the lower tier of the, tiers of the crypt. Yo! I think that's everything I need to know. The banshee's body is buried under the crest of the lion. She's a granddaughter, so she'll be on the bottom row, and she was the third one to pass away. Yo, that's so cool! That's so cool! Let's go, let's go! Let's go, lesbians! Let's go! Come on. There we go. Run. Run, chicken lady. Run with those chicken feet! Hustle, hustle. We can get there. Oh, you're back. Find out anything about our predicament? Seems like you've got a grave robber, grave robber on the loose. The banshee had a brooch stolen from her family crypt. A grave robber? Oh, damn those despicable degenerates. With these increasing ghosts, I haven't been able to do my nightly patrols. I need to get to the crypt and find her body. The thief might have left something behind. Well, good luck. That place is, has more spiders than I have liver spots, so you'll understand if I stay behind. Well, I wasn't going to ask you to come over, because I've been doing everything on my own anyways. Not me stuck in the tree. I promise. Oh, 
apothecary humors, liquid life as proven by modern medicine science, medical science. Interesting. Okay, okay. I'm not worried about the spider. This is the lion. Hey, go away! Go away! Yeah, die. Annoying. Anyways. Hmm, this doesn't seem like the right cast. Okay, so this was... This one? This doesn't seem like the right cast. Here. You dig your nails underneath the loose plaque and begin to pull. The rust bolts pop out of the corners of the end cap and the whole thing rips off the mossy wall. You toss away the grave cover and peer inside the dark hollow, holding your lamp aloft. Dozens of small, beady eyes blink back at you. Ew! No! Rats! You quickly jump aside as a torrent of vermin come pouring out from the coffin. Filthy little biters. Come to pill for more graves. Squeaking and hissing, they flow like some lumpy fluid. Ew! They flow like some lumpy liquid rushing back towards the entrance. You get the feeling that these rats are far more organized than normal pests. Where are you off to, little devils? Running back to your master, perhaps? Abandoned church. 
heavy chains bind up the gate in the rusted padlock is well beyond accepting any sort of key. Something more potent will be needed to open it. Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and make that. Please let me have everything to make that already. That'd be fantastic. I don't think I will. Nope, I don't. start on a new mission at the beginning of the next stream on Wednesday. That would be perfect. Alright, so I need my hatchet. And I need a log. get aggro with me all you want, bro. I'm not concerned about you. Come do something. Come do something. Oh, you're too slow? Too bad. I gotta do something about you. Like, it's, in, it's impassable Hulk unless perhaps he likes you. Oh, well, I don't know how to get your attention. I frankly don't want to right now. Come get it. Come get it. I want your eyes. I want your eyes. What's oh, another one? No. There's another tree. There's one down here for sure. So, of course, right next to the aggro. Love that, love that. She's go over here because it's not so bad. Is there not another one down here? to it. I hate you. No. I'm not wasting this on you. Bring yourself over here. Where are you going? Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Go away. I do not want to get hit. I don't. I don't feel like dealing with it. Uh, let's do another one. Maybe I can get close to that... One that had the aggro. Yeah! Stay all the way over there, bud. Oh, is there none? Okay, that's nice. Cool. There we go, there we go. More mushrooms, because you never know when you're going to need them. Might as well take these snail shells, because you never know when we're going to need them. I think I just want to get one more log cut. Yeah, I just want to get one more log. And then... We can focus on whatever else we need to- Stop! Go away! Damn. Ok, 
Okay, now you need to go away. So I can go and get that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And the stick. Thank you. Alright. I think we are good to go. So let's go ahead and make what we need to. Which is... To do this. We need to make more light. More to that. Ah! Of course I have to go to the field. Okay. Is this... No, it's just the forest path. Uh, I'll go back up over here. It's always one thing or another. Always something. That's fine, though. I'd much rather deal with the field than having to come over here and farm stuff. Alright, back to the field, back to the field. Let's try and collect as many of these lazy grass as possible. We're almost done, folks. We're almost there! We're almost there! Almost! I sure can. Awesome. Can I get some eggs out of here? Thank you! Give me all your eggs. All of them. Okay. I know there should be some lazy grass up here. Yep, there it is. Thank you, thank you, thank you kindly. Now, let's make what we need to make. Mm. One of those, so that I can make one of these. Mm. Bet. Now, let's go open up that abandoned church. like 20 minutes. Goddamn rats everywhere! Yo! Oh, I don't like these. Common rodent, the pigeon of the earth. Yes, they are! Jars and nails. We'll take those. stack of boxes slide aside to reveal a hidden crack in the wall. Ooh! 
into the shadows. Oh god, there's more of y'all. If this rat is ugly as hell, I'm not gonna be surprised. But please. Oh, it's gonna be so ugly. It's gonna be so ugly. Okay. Oh, actually, it's not that bad. It's an albino rat. Okay. Hey, who in the blazes are you? Who let you in, huh? I let myself in. You should really hide your secret lair a bit better. Though I must admit, this is quite the collection you've acquired here. Why? What's it to you? You're looking to make a trade? We got whatever you need, sister. If you can pay the price, that is. As a matter of fact, I am looking for an old antique brooch, and I heard you're the one to talk to. Yeah, we got plenty of brooches, Cloak. Oh, weird. Okay. Alright, OBS, what are you freaking out about? That was so weird. Okay. Sorry if there was any weirdness in the stream, OBS disconnected real quick. Don't know why. Alright. The vermin flips open his cloak and you see it's lined with rows and rows of jewelry. You lean in for a closer look. The items are all look like priceless family heirlooms, but you can't pick out the one belonging to the banshee. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'll need to confer with my friends as to which is the right one. The rat narrows his eyes suspiciously and hides his wares behind his cloak. And just who is this friend of yours? Why, she's the original owner, of course. She would very much like her property returned to her. No deal! We don't make trades with the dead. But you're happy enough to steal from them? Let me just go tell my friend where your little hideout is. I'm sure she'll be very persuasive. Well, she'll be more persuasive than myself. Fool! This place is sacred ground. No bad spirits can enter here. Now get out before we pick you clean. You ain't gonna do nothing to me, little shit. Alright, alright. No need to be cross. I ain't scared of y'all at all. In fact, I'm gonna go steal from you. Turkey gizzard stone? As effective a grinder for a witch as it was for a turkey. Oh, okay. Interesting. the church altar. Okay. There ain't nothing I can steal in here. Anything else I can steal? You nasty little vermin. No spirits may cross the threshold, eh? Well then, I'll just have to invite one in myself. You eye the flat surface of the barren altar. It looks like the perfect place to conduct a seance. Ha! This'll be fun. Spirit board. Alright. Okay, so I have a bone. I need to make... I need to make a necromancy charm and a wicked gemstone. Ooh. Okay, what is this? Dog hair. Okay, I need to put that dog out there to sleep. And I need... Oh, I have to get more bone. I don't like those things. What do you mean? That's fine, though. So I can make their little snag vines. I should kill all three. Just to make sure. And I think I will. Oh, never mind. I think I won't. Where was... Where's my entrance? Was it here? Yeah. Oh, well, let's see. I don't know if I can get this in the next 10 minutes, but hey. I'm still gonna keep going until this mission is finished! Alright, so. Let's see. I need to head to the
Little Jack Skellingtons. Here to bust your goddamn kneecaps. Cause I'm almost there. I'm almost there. I'm not going the right way. I never know when I'm going the right way. I don't think I'm going the right way. I think I need to head back. Oh my goodness, I did it again. I did it again, folks. Cause my brain ain't no work. Hey! Hey! Yeah, no. Fuck. Chop! Hate you little bastards. Where's another one I can get? Nah, cause you two like to keep grouping together. Where's another one? I know there's another one I can get. Where's another one? Is it just you? burning passion. Anyways. Necro charm. Necro charm. And for this I need dog hair. I think there was actually a dog over here, wasn't there? Wait, hold on. What do I need to put a dog to sleep? I don't remember now. Oh, I don't remember now. There was a dog though. I just don't remember if the dog was here or back in the forest. I was hoping there would be a dog here, but if not, then oh well. What's this? No, that's the Ox's farm. I don't think there was a dog there. I had to go back to the forest. Alright. I think there was a way for me to go back to the forest from here, right? Not there. All the way up there. And that's the way to Apiary. No, there was... Into the forest, okay. Into the thick of it! Ah! Almost there, man, almost there. We pushing through. We're pushing through, folks. Ah! Alright, let's keep it moving. all of these because I'm sure I need these sooner or later. Nah, come here. I know sooner or later I'll need all of you little things. was a little further up here. Past the well. Yeah. There was a mean dog over here. That put to sleep and that sheared him bald. Let's go do that again, shall we? Wait, it was up here, was it? No, it wasn't. Was it maybe more this way? No. Where on earth? village no there was a man is it this house i think it might be this house yeah i think it was this house yeah this is this. i think i don't know anymore i don't know anymore man no this was heading towards the village okay so i think maybe the new is this way There we go. Hello, handsome man. You. What was you? Sporic morsel, which I believe I have. 
I sure do. You can bark all you want. Go eat the food, yep. Thank you. That's all for now. Oh shit. I know I can get more, but alright. Cool. I got that. Let's craft. And then I can make... I made this already. Cool, cool, cool. I don't know why I needed that, but okay. Let's make the spirit board! Cool, let's go back. Oh, nice. Um, oh yeah, let's go through the village and then I can head down from the village to the graveyard. I should be able to... Yeah, that, that should work. That should work, hopefully. I'm sorry that this is taking so long. It's a bunch of running around for this game, unfortunately. That's one of my biggest gripes about it. As much as I love this, it's still very annoying. Okay, so this was in here to the graveyard. Okay. Oh no. Kid! down this way for the graveyard. I like that gives you like little markers to tell you, hey, you're getting near this area. There's a bunch of gravestones to represent that you're going towards the graveyard. I do like that. I'm just excited to get more of the story. Concentrating hard, you try to focus your thoughts towards the haunted mansion. Hello, can you hear me? Show me a sign. The planche begins to twitch and move, slowly tracing out letters on the board. Who is this? Oh, come now. Who else would it be? I'm calling to let you know I found where the rat is. You might want to come down here and speak to him. The lights flicker within the halls and dim down until you are drenched in total darkness. Only a blood-red glow throbs from the altar. Wind rushes through the church, and you can hear the squealing of rats as they dive for cover. On the gale come the screams of the dead, reverberating through the halls. The spirit board shudders and splits with the noise, and a skeletal hand claws its way out from the peephole of the cracked planche. Here, I can smell him. You go get him, girl. Right through that crack in the wall, actually. The vengeful spirit howls and flies straight through your body as she sweeps down into the rat's hideout. Ugh, that's chilly. Wait for me, I need to see how this ends. Yeah, we like the drama. We like the drama. Got my popcorn ready. Oh, she didn't tell him a new one. You, you dare take from me. How did you, wait, it's just a simple misunderstanding. I didn't. Even in your hour of judgment, you lie. The rat's bulging eyes lock onto you in desperation. Oh, don't look at me, buddy. This is your doing, isn't it? You let her in here. 
<laughs> the drama. I'm here for the tea. I am merely helping to settle a dispute. You thought all your grave robbing wouldn't come with consequences? Face justice for your crimes, thief. The dead have come for you. <laughs> Eats popcorn. Yes. The banshee whirls around like a hurricane, drawing with her in innumerable hosts of ghosts and spirits. No! No! Get off us! You wretches! You were dead! Finders keepers! Nah, buddy. Spectral claws grab onto the rat and his verminous minions and drag them squealing into the underworld. Ooh, golly! Yo! With a crack of thunder, the howling wind evaporates. Not a single rat remains. A calm falls over the banshee as she reaches down and picks up one of the scattered brooches left on the floor. My... my brooch. It's back. It's safe. I can finally sleep. She clutches her treasure to her breast and looks at you with a final crooked smile before fading away in a glimmer of ghostly smoke. In the eerie silence of the cave, you see something squirming in the debris. Ew! It's a bunch of rat tails! You brush aside some pilfered treasure and uncover a writhing mass, mass of pink rat tails, tangled together like worms. Ugh. Looks like they got all knotted up trying to escape. The soul of the rat. Yo! Hell yeah, guys! We did it! You sense the souls of the fish, cat, rat, and ram pulsed with captive malignancy. The goat will be wanting to take custody of these four. Best not to keep him waiting. The rat quest completed! Let's go, guys! Yeah! Alright, so let's go back to the portal and we will um, end it there. Thank you guys so, so, so much for sticking around this long. I mean, it's still the two hours, but thank you guys for sticking around. I really appreciate you guys showing up. Oh, wait, hold on. I just want to make sure there's anything. No? Okay, cool. Alright, so you guys should be dis disappearing then because there's no more wailing to keep you up and awake and not resting but thank you guys so much for joining it it truly truly helps the channel um i know that i do this just for fun but if i'm able to grow this then i think it would be pretty fun i'd be able to play some different type of games upgrade the setup for you guys so there's not so many technical difficulties um i'd love to be able to try and go to different conventions and some of the fans as well. That'd be really nice. I mean, if, if, for right now, I think that's just a pipe dream, but maybe further down the line. But I am going to end the stream here. Thank you guys so, so, so much for joining. Um, just like in the beginning, if you like this type of content, if you want to see more of the game, I think we're a good chunk of the way through this. Probably another round of collecting some more souls. Um, after we give the four that we have to the ghost, I have a feeling, I think I had to get like five of these before, so it might be either three or two, but we'll see. But thank you guys so much for joining, I really appreciate you guys, thank you so much, and I will see you guys in the next stream on Wednesday. Again, it's every Monday and Wednesday from 6pm to 8pm, I know my birthday this year is on a Tuesday. No. Is it? Yeah, my birthday's on a Tuesday this year, but I will be out of town on Monday hitting up the roller coasters at Universal. So I will either stream on my birthday or I will stream Sunday before we leave. Um, still gotta figure that out, but I will let you guys know um, when we get closer to 
probably flip a coin or roll some dice. We'll see. But I think by I think by February 13th, um, we should be done with the game and probably heading into our next one. Um, just like in the last stream, if there's a game that you want me to try out, by all means, please leave a comment. Um, I'll put up a poll just to see like what games I have at the moment that you guys may want to try out. I know I said that I want to do Baldur's Gate for the channel. I've been really enjoying that in my own spare time, but there's still so many routes I haven't taken. Um, there's so many characters I want to try and make, so many characters I want to romance. Um, but yeah, uh, we're going to end it there for tonight. Thank you guys so, so much for showing up. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. Please like, subscribe, and I will see you guys on Wednesday.